for a chemical to be suggested as a persistent organic pollutant, or POP, that is to say, some of the organic chemicals that we are most concerned about when it comes to environmental pollution, because they just don't break down in a timely fashion, a compound needs to fulfill the following four criteria. The chemical must remain intact for exceptionally long periods of time, i.e. many years, it must become widely distributed throughout the environment as a result of natural processes involving soil, water, and especially air. It needs to accumulate in living organisms, including humans, and be found in higher concentrations at higher levels in the food chain. And at last, it needs to be toxic to both humans and other organisms. And it turns out, the far remote regions of the Arctic and Antarctic make for excellent places to identify some of the chemicals that qualify for that list.